this is the spot I'm tearing up today. Plotting baby in the building. Good morning, all my oven party people. Let me run past these folks and then I'll holla at you real quick. So I'm at the uh, the Holiday Inn Resort on Okaloosha Island, and uh, today we're getting ready to do a pool. If I get up to get in this gate, there we go. This one's a pretty big job, man. They they got a uh, a little lazy river and shit here. So that's pretty cool. I gotta watch. I gotta watch my cursing, cause YouTube coming for all you dirty mouth. See, <laughs> it's hard, boy. It's hard. But yeah, yeah. I'll give you a look at the pool, y'all. This big pool, and you see the lazy river coming around there. Pop out here, and then bloop. Take a run to the tiki bar. So. Once again, I started mad early. I'm out here. I gotta pressure wash every square inch of this thing. So, I'm gonna do that. Let me run up here real quick. We have our little morning talk. Ooh, that sun beaming right on the huh? Sun beaming right at you, ain't it? All right, this is better. Look at that one. It looks like gutter brain. <laughs> hey, so. Last week I had like a complete meltdown. And. It was. Just stupid. This week. I am doing everything this week with like intention. Doing everything this week with gratitude. I'm doing everything this week. With staying on task. You know, um. I was flipping out, but once I stopped and calmed down and looked at everything, I was like, there's nothing I can't handle. <laughs> and there's nothing going on that I cannot handle. And then the things that I should be implementing to strengthen my journey or to get me closer to where I want to be. Uh, I wasn't doing and there's nobody to blame but me now you could bitch there's not enough hours in the day there's not this there's not that but gotta make sacrifices you know what I mean can't binge watch that show with your girl that's hours that you could have been taking steps you know man I got a gym membership and I have not been going consistently I went a couple times and then I let the the tiredness get to me I let the comfortableness get to me so I'm just hopping on now to say it's Monday morning. I'm here at work. I got a good attitude. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling filled with life. I'm feeling um, peaceful. There's not a lot of stuff that's... There's things that I could allow to stress me if I allowed them to stress me. But I'm not going to allow them to stress me. You know what I mean? Um, I'm blessed, man. I could just say... I'm cool right here. I'm just going to do this. And I can live a decent life. You know what I mean? Like, you wouldn't, wouldn't be uh, bawling or nothing, but I ain't broke. You dig? And, um, I don't know. I think it's bigger than money at this point. It's about legacy. It's about, I told y'all motherfuckers I was going to do it, so I'm going to do it. There. It's a lot of stuff, man. Um, I, had, I had somebody hit me up. I sent out I sent out my, my the, the level up song to a couple people. And uh, the mixer wasn't right. Just left a bad taste in my mouth. I keep trying to get a hold of these people. They, they're like, yeah, 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 you. And in one hand, I'm like, man, fuck y'all. And on the other hand, it's like, man, I understand. They're running their own business there. They, you're like, but, uh. 
they ain't gonna have too much business if they keep it up like this so i flim flammed i booked another session i got a two more songs i'm gonna go record not even going to attempt to have these people make some while I'm in the studio. I'm going to have those sessions sent out. I've multiple times hit this dude up like, yo, just email me the session because I have people that I can send it to that will do what they do. But um, he just hasn't yet. I've talked to him two times. Hey, man, blah, 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 can you send it to me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he just don't do it, you know. And then uh, with my attitude, I'll I be catching my attitude. <laughs> I. I kind of like when on on the day that I I should be calling them, I don't because I don't want to freak out. But then I'm like, nah, I I don't know what this is. I feel like the like the old me has died, but the new me is not like fully formed yet. So I haven't really. I'm second I'm second guessing myself on on situations where I would just react and know how to react. Uh, now I'm second guessing myself because I'm like, is this right? Is this the, the, you know, is this the me that I'm trying to be? You know what I mean? So we'll see. But I just want to say, journey keep going, bros. We will keep doing it. Please consider subscribing if you haven't. And uh, we got a lot of shit coming. Just got to be executed properly. Some people tell me, no, it fucking don't. They'll be like, Yo, no, it don't. Just fucking do it and you'll figure it out. That's what a lot of getting from a lot of my people. Like, yo, you're, you're obsessing over this one fucking sound for two weeks when you could have put the song out and not said nothing and nobody would have noticed it. But I notice it. And I say, would Dr. Dre have put out that fucking song? The same thing I say, was, uh, would Puffy been waiting this song for the message? Fuck no, he would have been at the door with his shirt off. Diddy time, baby. And that's what I'm trying to get into. But I can't be on my Diddy time while I'm doing this shit. Because then I start to resent this shit. You know, the pool life. That shit. Look, nice pool one over here. Oh, look at that. You see what I'm saying, dog? I be bitching about work. Look, this is my, my view from the office. gotta be grateful for what you got man it's not a, i saw a thing the other day with steve harvey and he was like yo if you have twenty thousand dollars and you want to be a millionaire and then god bring you up to fifty thousand dollars but you're mad about that 50 because you're not a millionaire and you should be grateful for that 50 and the gratitude is what will bring you up to, to 150 and i get that so much man i get that so much because uh Life is crazy. I be falling into a lot of shit. You know what else is crazy? The other day, we were out here working, draining the pool and everything. And, uh, dude had to go to the bathroom. Come on, he's out there. Somebody living in that bathroom. So we went to the bathroom. And sure enough, there was somebody. Had a whole tent and shit in the handicap stall. And now I can't get in this motherfucker to pee. So I'm about to roll my pretty ass into this fancy resort and uh, find me a restroom or I'm gonna pee in the bushes because when you gotta go you gotta go man nature be calling okay. so I'm about to run in here I just want to say I appreciate every one of y'all that spend any amount of time watching this shit and uh, trust me by this time next year Y'all gonna watch these videos and laugh and be like, boy, that boy done did something with it.